Hello students, today we make dual axis solar tracker. Now start the project. First we open Tinker CAD, that is the Tinker CAD. Now search the component, Arduino, Arduino UNO, drag and drop here. And now search photo resistor, photo resistor. You can also say the name of LDR. L LDR light dependent resistor. You can also photo resistor and LDR also. Take four LDR. Now take four resistor. And now open servo. Servo motor. Take two servo motor. Rotate the servo motor. Click on click here and rotate and rotate this. Again, you take one servo motor and rotate the servo. Now, also search the breadboard. Breadboard. Take this breadboard. Nay, take small breadboard. This one. First we connect 5 volt to the breadboard work to red now connect the ground pin to the breadboard work to black again you can bypass this 5 volt positive pin connect to here and negative pin connect here. that is negative line if you connect to the pin here then power will be goes all line and positive is all line now connect the resistor LDR take one resistor to the break take one resistor to the LDR and now paster pin connect to the ground and second pin of LDR connect to the positive of the breadboard now go to A0 pin connect to the LDR you have connected LDR now second register connect to the LDR And register pin connect to ground. You can shift like that. And second pin of LDR connect to the positive of the breadboard. That is red and that is black. Again, A0 and A3 are same. Now connect the LDR. Connect it again. Now connect second and connect these two LDR. Take resistor 1 and resistor 2 and both resistor goes to GND. GND and GND and second terminal of resistor for LDR goes to positive means red that means also red LDR is connected now connect the analog pin A1 pin connect to the connect to the third LDR now change the color green and A2 pin connect to first LDR. Give A2 pin connect to the first LDR. Now LDR is connected. Now we connect the servo motor. Positive of the servo connect to the breadboard. 
positive both servo connect to the positive to the breadboard and negative connect to the negative of the breadboard that is negative portion again we connect to the negative signal pin connect to the it digital Arduino 10 pin digital pin connect to the Arduino 10 pin and second servo connect to the 9 pin of Arduino Nine pin of Arduino. Now, circuit is completed. First LDR, first and A0 and A3 LDR for first one motor and A1 and A2 for the second second servo. Connection is completed. Now, click on the code. Click on the code section and click click on the block and select the text and continue. Code will be given in the description. You can click the link and copy the code. I will copy here code. You can see A0 of LDR and A3 of LDR for the bottom left, bottom right side and A1 and A2 left and right both top left top right now you can see servo motor of well, horizontal servo motor connect to the 9 pin and vertical servo motor connect to the 10 pin now you can search red solar that is solar panel solar solar panel put it on the servo motor now start simulate and you can see the servo motor will be operate. Click on the LDR and change the value of LDR and see the motor will be operating. Now you can see that one servo is operating. You can see. Servo change the value. If LDR gives the value, then servo will operate like that. In second LDR, you can see servo, servo is operating. Now third LDR, in servo will operate. And the last one, four. Four, servo is not operating. One a minute. Wait a minute because project is not working because LDR value sensor value is 1k. We have to put 10k. Click on 0, 10k. Change the value of resistor 1k to 10k. Then project will be operate fine. Click here and 0. Now start simulate. Now you can see first LDR. Servo is not operate for this LDR. You can check the value. One minute. We have connect the connection wrong. Stop here and click here and change the connection. We have connect to here, not in the register. Now start simulate. Now it work properly. Click here and you can see servo is operating. First, first LDR. Now click on the second LDR, then servo is operating. And second LDR, servo is operating. And the last LDR, you can see servo operate one by one. Change the value. can see the project is operating if you have not subscribed the channel please subscribe the channel 
and also click on the bell icon button then my next video will be notified to you project is completed code also given in description you can download the code and paste the code in arduino id and tinkercad if you make if you make a hardware project then use arduino id if you use tinkercad then you make this circuit like that and paste the code in the text block and start simulate and see the output project is all working thank you all friends